Greetings, everybody out there in Botland. My name is RJ Redden, and entrepreneurs hire me to rocket launch their marketing message because most of them have a terrible time getting engagement on and offline. So I create messaging that builds relationships and closes deals. Bottom line, you got to get your butt out there. You must be botastic in order to sell smarter, not harder. Anyway, here we are. I am just popping on to do a real short show because today I'm not feeling so well and I need to roll and see, they, you know, the doctor place. I need to go visit them. But before I go, I just wanted to check in with you all and tell you that many chat had, of course, their big conference this weekend. They seem to 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 wait every update until this this conference. You know what I'm saying? So there were a whole bunch of updates. But there were a couple that I think that you'll be particularly interested in. And I'll do a longer show on this a little bit later. So one thing, the biggest thing probably that they introduced is this. And that is that they will be added. Well, they have already added texting to their... Uh, to they'll be adding the ability to text people. This comes, of course, on the heels of Facebook's announcement that no one's going to be able to do broadcasting past the first of the year. Um, so this gives people a little bit of time to adjust uh, what they're doing. So now, it, you know, after the first of the year, instead of sending a broadcast message, one option will be to use many chats texting system to text folks. Now, um, it's in its baby stages. You know, they worked on this thing all night to get it to work before the conference. You know, it's exactly that kind of thing. Um, but it, the, you know, they did get it out there and, uh, and it's, it's a lot, it's helpful to people. One thing that I will say is that I'm going to be sticking with simple texting the reason being that I feel, well, A, uh, the texts are cheaper on simple texting. Um, if you use many chat system, it's three cents per text. Um, and that's just text, not, uh, not uh, texting a picture or anything like that. You're, it's just words. So that's a bit expensive for the functionality that they're offering us. Um, also there's no, you know, there's no short code that you can text to or anything like that. So it's in its baby stages. I'll be sticking with simple texting, uh, certainly at least for the moment. They also, one of the other, uh, addendums, uh, was email. They added the ability to email people to, uh, uh, to engage with your bra, to engage with your stuff. Um, this one didn't quite get as much of a standing ovation. Um, you know, most people are migrating away from email. Why would we go back to it? I think that's more of a niche product that some people will want to engage with. Um, that, that's, you know, some people are just really, really used to the old system and they want to go traditionally and they'll want to engage people uh, i.e. get them into you, get them back into the chat bot to visit you again, but they'll, they'll want to use email to do that. Um, so uh, that one's okay. There's also a couple of integrations that were, you know, that are going to be cool for people. Anybody out there using active campaign, you will now be able to integrate that into your many chat directly. No use of Zapier, which is nice for people. Uh, people don't always love Zapier. Um, and, you know, I mean, I, I know why I've been there. Anyway, um, so there's the integration with Active Campaign. There's also an integration with Shopify. If you use that for your website or your products, you will be able to integrate that directly with ManyChat. Uh, that is a powerful thing uh, as well. And then there were other, there were other things. Um, some were coming soon announcements, um, coming soon, apparently a, um, an app, uh, an app so that you can manage your live chat. 
uh, coming soon, an improved flow builder apparently as well. Um, so there were there were a few coming soon announcements too, and a few kind of quality of life behind the scenes improvement. But by by far, by and large, the biggest announcements was uh, that they're adding SMS to many chats. So if you want to use SMS for people to engage your stuff from many chat, you can do it right there in the interface. You do have to go and get. You have to sign the terms of it, the terms of endearment. I almost said. You know I'm not feeling well, right? Uh, the terms of engage, uh, terms of engagement, terms and conditions. You do have to go through that and sign the terms and conditions, saying that you will use your powers wisely and for good. Um, you do also have to go and get explicit permission from people to text them. You cannot just. If you have a phone number for them in your records, you cannot just go texting them right now. No, no. There are laws that govern texting and it is good to know them. Um, the laws that cover texting are, are pretty simple. You need to let people know that they can reply stop to get out. Um, they can, uh, you know, just really the same things that we talk about with uh, you, the same things we talk about using with um, our Facebook messaging. Let them know that they can stop. Um, let them know, you know, a proxy, you know, be a transparent about how many times you're going to text them. Uh, different, different things like that. So it will behoove you to read through those things. If you want to use the SMS with ManyChat, I do suggest you read through the terms and conditions. I also suggest that you read up a little bit on text messaging before you start sending them. It's 160 characters. Uh, if you include a link, use a link shortener to shorten that link. Otherwise, half of your message is your link. That's a lot. Um, so, uh, so there are some things to remember. There are some tips and guidelines. Of course, I'll be talking about these in the coming months uh, because I'm experimenting with this now. I'm using some stuff, doing th some things with some people, as you know, uh, and getting this, uh, getting this out there so that I can test it well before everybody else uh, needs to use it. Um, so that, that was the big announcement from ManyChat this week, uh, this weekend. Um, there's, you know, tons of articles up on their blog if that's, you know, where you care to go. Um, for me, um, I also know uh, the, that the, you know, I'm a certified partner up at TrueChat and they are going to be getting integrated texting uh, by the end of the year and probably, I mean, maybe a little sooner since this announcement about ManyChat came out, but they'll be getting integrating, te integrating texting as well. Don't know, um, don't know any of the particulars right now. I'll keep you updated as we go. Um, but those, uh, that will be integrated in to the platform, which I like, uh, because right now, I'm managing, you know, several accounts for people. Uh, and it would be nice to have all of that just in one place. Uh, so that's good stuff. Hey, Lori, morning, darling, driving, not right now. Have a tremendous day. It will be a tremendous day. I'm visiting the doctor right after this, so you know how tremendous it's going to be. Uh, anyway, uh, let's see here. So, so <clears throat> talking about True Chat. They're going to be integrating that the texting as well. So by the end of the year, um, I'll be on their system as well, uh, which will be nice. Um, TrueChat also made a lot of improvements. And by the way, they already have a live chat app, an app you can manage your live chat on. Um, they already have, you know, kind of a lot of things that, that many chat is adding. So, um, so it's interesting. Uh, it's interesting. One of the things that, I think is really, really nice is, uh, is true chat is adding, um, chatbot landing pages. Uh, so right now they're at a conference at a digital marketing conference and talking to people about using chatbots for a landing page, uh, which I've already been integrating into a few of my clients plans. And I already have one 
for myself, although the bot isn't built. I mean, you know, sometimes, you know, that happens. Uh, my bots are always the last to get built. We have so many, it's a, it's a wealth of beautiful customers who need their stuff built first. Anyway, um, so uh, they're, they're doing a lot of really cutting edge things with, uh, with the chat bots. And, and that's where I think that the future is. Um, you know, for, for, for me getting, reducing my dependence and reducing my client's dependence upon messenger, using it where needed, but also, you know, being able to do some different things off, off campus, so to speak, uh, and, uh, to be able to integrate different modalities and, and ways of doing things. I think that really is, uh, is the future uh, of, of chatbots, really. Um, you know, Facebook uh, does what they do. And, uh, and I know that a lot of you out there have been wondering, you know, what is going to happen? Well, let me tell you, text messaging, um, it has a better open rate than even Facebook Messenger. And if people love your bot, if people want to hear what you have to say, if you're delivering value to people, they're going to click the button to go into your bot. They just are. They're going to be happy to see your face, basically, and want to know what you have to say. So the things that we talk about on this show, and we talk about them a lot, we talk about let's bring value to people. Let's make sure that they are they're getting what they need from the bot that it's not just a, Oh, we've got their name. Now we can market to them. Like market is this big, huge, cool word. No, not always. Sometimes what we need to do is provide that value and build the no like trust factor so that when people come to you, they wouldn't go anywhere else. Um, that's what chatbots are all about. It's all about creating a vastly superior customer service experience and a vastly superior lead capture experience. So I'm going to cut this short because, as you know, I'm not feeling super well. Uh, I'm going to roll on to the doctor and see what they have to say to me. And uh, hopefully it's good, you know. Um, but anyway... Thanks for joining me today. I'm going to share this everywhere. If you have questions, pop them on here or pop them in the group. Black Belt Bots community always there for you. Um, or if you want to just private message me, that's cool too. I think the future of chatbots is very, very bright. It's very bright. And it is, it's not going to stop at Facebook. It's not going to stop with okay, we've been able to send messages for free for a long time. Now, what are we going to do? We're going to keep writing awesome things. We're going to keep writing things that help people want to get to know us. And we're going to keep writing things that perform for our people, that deliver that value and that bring people into our circle a little bit closer. That's what we're going to do. We're going to experiment with a few ways to get out there for people. Hopefully Facebook will, uh, you know, make their, well, that was another promise of many chat over the weekend that they'd have a little bit more friendly uh, interface with, uh, with Facebook, um, you know, in order to send some, you know, segmented, hopefully messages out um, that, uh, you know, we'll see if that happens or not. Uh, again, that was a future thing. And so it wasn't anything that's ready right away. We'll see. We'll see if sponsored messaging is, is worth exploring. Text messages are definitely worth exploring and I'm doing so right now. Um, also true chat has changed their prices. Uh, they're now offering so much that the $30 level is just not working out for them anymore. Um, so if you're already in, you're in. Don't worry about it. If you are not in, um, there are a few of you that I've been talking with. If you want to get in, uh, do let me know at, at the old price. I do have some very limited, very limited stuff available. And I, I do want you to, I, I do want to know that you'll use it. So uh, get a hold of me. 
And uh, that's all that I have for today. I need to roll and I need to, I need to do something about uh, the sickness and I will, I'm actually going to be coming on tomorrow at four o'clock. I'm going to interview Jane Powers and have her uh, chat about that challenge that we're putting on over in her group. Not too late to join. And uh, yeah, that is really all that I know. Uh, have a wonderful, fabulous day, darlings. And I'll see you in a bot.